Welcome to 321 Photoshop. I'm Julianne Cost. Here are five different ways to change the canvas size of a document in Photoshop. First, in order to avoid filling the added canvas area with the background color, I'll convert the background into a layer by clicking the lock icon. Then I'll choose Image and Canvas Size. I'll enter the values that I want the final canvas size to be and choose an anchor point. In this case, I want to anchor the photograph to the center of the canvas. When I zoom out, we can see that Photoshop has added that canvas and it's transparent because I'm not working with the background layer. All right, let's undo that. And the second way, I'll return to Image, Canvas Size, but this time I want to add a 0.25 inch border around my entire image. Instead of having to do the math, I'll check Relative and add 0.5 to both the width and the height. Again, I'll anchor the image in the center, click OK, and Photoshop will evenly divide the amount that I entered on both sides. The third way would be to use the Crop tool. I'll tap the C key and then drag to extend the canvas size and tap Return or Enter to apply that. To demonstrate the fourth way, let's use this text layer. I'll choose the Move tool and reposition it. I want Photoshop to automatically trim away any excess area, so I'll choose Image, Trim, base it on the transparent pixels, and click OK. Finally, if I use the Move tool and move that text layer down a little bit further, I can choose Image, Reveal All to have Photoshop add canvas size to accommodate all of the information on all of my layers.